hello friends in this video we will try to discuss how to handle the schema evaluation for the evaluation feature for the delta tables in databricks notebook so let's say when i say schema evaluation feature let's say the source csv had two columns one is employee id and second one is employee name okay and uh, for the next day whenever the data is getting inserted for the same csv that another new column has been added called ssn okay so the table has been created and it is written the data for the employee id and employee name and uh, unfortunately there is new column has been added that is called ssn so how are we going to handle a scenario when it occurs this type of scenario means that is called there is a feature called option uh, merge schema so using that option we can able to achieve this scenario so we will try to see that into practical now by, cre by creating the sample data so let's say we will try to create the delta table and then we will try to see practically by inserting the data create a replace table sample demo let's say employee id let's say employee name using delta location then we will pass the location file store tables sample demo so that table is created now we will try to insert the data for the above created table insert into let's see employee ID comma employee name let's say values one comma name is let's say Mahesh Let's run the insert statement. So one row is affected. Now we'll try to look up the data. Select star from sample demo. So we can able to add the one row. Okay, now we will try to create so we are going to create schema for the another table in order to open the data from pyspark dot sql dot types import struct type struct field integer type string type okay so in order to create the schema we required struct type and struct field and the data types now we'll try to define the data so let's say name is should employee id employee name and we'll try to insert the ssn number Now we'll try to define the schema. Struct type of field. Let's see. 
employee id integer type Let's see, this is send. to create the df out of the data which we created create data frame data equal to data comma schema equal to schema now display df So now we have created another record with newly added column called SSM. Okay. Now we will try to write the data. Okay. So df dot write dot format delta. mode let's say append dot save as table let's say so we are writing the data for the sample demo now we'll try to run and see so this has fetched the analysis exception because the source table has two columns and the incremental table has three columns so ssn has the ssn is the new column which is newly inserted for the existing source table so that's where basically the schema mismatch happened so how to handle this mismatch issue so my scenario has to allow the new column as well okay in that scenario we are going to use the merge schema option let's say option let's write merge schema let's say true okay and then let's define the mode append save as table for the same table sample data now we will try to run and see okay this has executed without any analysis exception because when we try to use the merge schema option if any newly added changes also that this can be allowed without throwing any analysis exception now we will try to see the data whether it is new record is inserted or not 
so let's start from the table name see both the records we can able to see the session is the newly added column and the first record is already existing column though we didn't inserted any column for this data hence it is showing the null okay so this is how for the newly added columns we can able to handle it by using the major schema option okay so that's all for today's case if you really like this video please do subscribe like it and share it and do the comment